you want to know how to code amazing applications with minimal effort and maximum creativity? Do you want to join a network of developers who share, reuse, and collaborate on code and data? Do you want to learn about a protocol that is revolutionizing the field of natural language processing and data mining? Well, if you answered yes to any of these questions, just keep watching this video. Hi, and welcome to Rapid Fire. In these videos, we will bring you the latest and greatest in the world of AI crypto. I'm Kenneth, and I want to talk to you about a very cool project that could change the way developers work and collaborate. It's a protocol that connects all developer tools into one network, and this fosters a more shareable, reusable, and open economy. And the name of this project? It is Commune. So, what is Commune? Well, imagine you could deploy your Python objects from anywhere. You could sync them with the network, and then access them from any device or platform. Imagine you could use any tool or framework that you like without having to worry about compatibility or integration issues. Imagine you could share your code and data with other developers and you could benefit from their contributions as well. I mean, this sounds fan freaking fantastic, right? Well, thanks to Commune, all of this is possible. You see, Commune is based on an inclusive design philosophy. This means that developers can leverage Commune as a versatile set of tools alongside their existing projects and also have the freedom to incorporate additional tools that they find valuable. You see, Commune is not a platform or a framework, but it's a protocol that enables interaction and collaboration among all developer tools. Commune is also very easy to use and set up. You can even install it with or without Docker, depending on your preference. Once you have it installed, you can deploy your Python objects from anywhere using a simple command line interface. You then can access those objects from any device or platform using the Commune API. You can also browse other objects on the network and interact with them using the Commune Explorer. So you see, Commune has set it up so it's very easy for you to use. So, uh, why are you still here? Go and join the Commune community now! You can find more information about Commune on their GitHub page, on their socials, or as I prefer, on Discord. All the links are in the description. That's it for today's Rapid Fire. I hope you enjoyed it and that you learned something. And what project do you think is going to be the next big thing in AI crypto? Because I would honestly really like to know. Let us know in the comments. Thank you for watching Rapid Fire. I'm your host, Kenneth, and I'm signing off. <laughs>